All praises to Haya Ashura Haya, my Shemi Shaya, Waka Nasha Waka. This is Shabar Israel, and today I would like to talk about the departure of the Messiah, Matthew 7 uh, 23. Because the Messiah has shown me a very prophetic dream concerning the Messiah and his departure. And so I appeared on a bus, and I was wearing a white robe, and the bus was filled with people, a specific type of people. And there was a man sitting beside me, and we began to conversate. There was a woman there, and the bus was crowded, and she was giving out plates of food. And so she proceeded to come to the front of the bus, where she handed me a plate. And by the time I turned around, the man that was there beside me was gone. There was a man on the left-hand side of the bus, and he told me that, he left, he got off the bus. And I said, oh, uh, okay. And I said, well, what about the woman? She's missing too. And he said, well, she went to go give a certain man uh, some food and said she will be back. And I said, okay, well, I'm getting off the bus and I'm following the man. And so when I got off the bus, there was an opening there, like uh, two pillars. And when I peeped behind the pillar, there was a dog there, it was a poodle. It looked as if it was missing uh, some of its fur. So instead of eating my plate, I handed it to the poodle. And then I began to proceed to follow after the man, and then it ended. I received wisdom, instruction, and understanding concerning this. Now, the bus that we were on was a so-called church bus. You see that? And the man beside me talking to me was none other than the Messiah. Now, the woman there, she was a Hebrew. There were mainly Hebrews on the bus. And she was feeding the Christian church uh, from the members that I knew in the setting of the Baptist church. And uh, the man, like I stated, was none other than the Messiah sitting beside me. Before he got off the bus, he said one thing. He stated, they have built a house that was not mine. And so when I turned around, he departed. And so when I got off the bus, there was a dog there. And the dog was hungry. So I fed the dog. And so what is the Most High saying here? In Matthew, the seventh chapter, the 23rd verse, it tells us that Christ is going to tell a certain group of people, depart from him. I know you not, ye workers of iniquity. What is he saying? I'm not even going to give you the time to depart. I'm getting up and I'm leaving. And this is what the Messiah has done. You see that? This is where we're at. And as far as uh, the dog goes, the Canaanite woman. You see that in the book of Luke. Christ said, is it unlawful for him to take the children's bread and give it to dogs? And she said, the dogs got to eat. They eat crumbs. You know, you see that? What is Haya Ashur Ahaya saying? Shabar Yashara, the tribe of Gad. You fed the Hebrews. You fed the dogs. But the Messiah is departing even from the dogs. Don't even feed the dogs no more. You see that? Therefore, he has departed from these group of people, a.k.a. Christians. The book of John is stated that they were amongst us, but they departed from us. And now they are what? Antichrist. You see that? John around the 17th chapter. So once again, the Messiah had to depart when he was younger and then in his younger days because they were seeking to kill him. But now... He's saying that I am about to move because the most high, my father's getting ready to kill y'all. Why? Because this is the second time that I've seen a bus. And who was the driver? <laughs> this was a school bus, though. None other than Haya Ashura Haya. He was driving the bus, and he told me he was going to visit the uh, Ninth District. That's over there in Tyree and Sidon. You see that? All the coast of Palestine, so-called Christians over there. Nevertheless, he's going to visit the whole congregation to the Hebrew first and the Gentile. You see that? Uh, as far as judgment, he was driving this bus and he showed me how they were treating him. And this was like maybe three or four years ago. Two to four years ago. It's been a while. So this is what's happening. The Most High was driving the bus because after all, he's in charge of everything, even Christ. At the head of Christ. At the head of Christ is the Most High, God, the one you call Haya or Ahaya. You see that? And he was driving 
the tribe of Gad. He was leading the tribe of Gad by the hand. And now he stated, well, now I turned it over to my son, and they have rejected my son once again. So now it's over. Tribe of Gad, you see that? Everybody's been sealed. You see that? Who needs to be sealed? It's over. So he's saying, tribe of Gad, also Genesis 49 and 19, is trying to vacate from amongst these people. You see that? He didn't waste no time getting off the bus. You see that? Ha, 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 yeah. Said, hush that fuss. The Messiah got off the bus. And I'm not talking Rosa Parks. You see that? So, those who have an ear, let them hear what the Spirit is saying. Chicago will be the first to fall. Jamestown, Virginia, the last standing. Watch ye therefore and pray always that ye may be accounted worthy to escape all these things that shall come to pass and to stand before the Son of Man. And for those who refuse to take part in the tree of life and to drink from the fountains of living water, let them be unjust still. And the bride say come, and the spirit say come, and the wife say come. Is shall you come? Thy kingdom come. Amen.